On the outside, it doesn't look like anyone's about to storm the doors. But inside, I'm starting to notice a real atmosphere. Thanks. I'm not sure anyone wants me here. We've already agreed not to show the faces of anyone who wants to remain anonymous. I'm pretty sure that this is the first time I've filmed anywhere where everyone insists on it. Rusha's topic today is the state of man. Maybe it's more controversial than I expected. Sorry to jump in front of the queue. I just want to say thank you for having us here, man. A lot of people have turned up today to hear you speak. The reason I came here is because the percentage of English men who read me is very large. And to, that is a weird thing because I'm not from, from here. But the problem is men are not allowed to speak the views that I am, am speaking. It takes an outsider to come here and not be afraid of the hate crime laws that you guys have to give the truth. And so I wish there were more men here who could share their views, but if they do, we all know that people are gonna go after their jobs and shame them. You've got all shapes and sizes in here. It is really a broad spectrum as well in terms of race and, and, and background. And it actually feels quite excitable in here. You know, there's a room for the men who are excited about what they're about to hear. So am I. Something has happened in the past 50 years where women are no longer trained to submit to a man to serve a man. The very idea of beauty and aesthetics is being demolished to where now women are being applauded and encouraged to look like fat outer space cyborgs. Women and gays are seen as superior to straight men. Anything that a woman or a gay person wants is theirs. But anything you want, sorry, we cannot help you. 